Hello everybody, Average Gamer here, and welcome back to another episode of Star Trek New Horizons as the Dominion, where we are going to, hopefully, in this episode, if not this episode, the next one, get revenge on the Krenim and the Horogen. Um, I need to look at the Krenim We will make quick. the time to speak with you. Can declare war on you. You just have a non-aggression pact with a Horogen. Corrogen can declare war on you. You have a non-aggression pack with the Krenum. Okay. So theoretically, I can go after the Horogen now. I mean, because that gives me the ability to get Idrin and tap. So if I do this, I'm going to leave a lot of these planets out. Anything that has the ability to get, you know, a planet, except for the demon ones. The demon ones, no one can colonize those, so. Polar demon, demon. So I'm going to take these, well, a couple systems probably. But we're going to let our fleets build back up here real quick. Uh, we still don't have the guys I want when it comes to that. Power is a little bit behind, and our dilithium is a little bit behind. So it's going to take a little while for us to kind of get things back up and running. That shouldn't be much of a problem. And then the better power core. That would be a good idea. Species 7889, the Ocean. Which are over here. Yep, the Ocean Hunters. Yeah. Oh, the Scytherian. Come. And you're going to come by here because there's someone here that needs to be met. Unless they get wiped out very soon. And it's just dilithium, right? Okay. It's going to quickly go boop. Okay. Not too worried about that stuff. I think with the Kravik, I can... Oh, there's a third one now. Okay, good to know. According to my observations, the humanoid is operating at optimal efficiency. Oh, we're not quite there yet. Okay. Oh, can't do that. We're going to do long-range scan. There we go. Um, so you're gonna start, we're going to start needing deuterium, which I think we have. Yeah, we're producing 14 of it. And we're producing water ice, right? Yep. So we can use the buildings that produce ice, which is you. You also use 12 power. So, but that, I think, use three of you, I think. I'd have to double check. Oh, yeah, so you're good. There we go. Let's get some Herogen. And let's see if we can get some Kabali. Not yet. We're close. Uh, Grab major torpedoes. I'm trying to beam some people over. Communication drone, 8 of 8. Oh, it was one of you. There we go. Uh, you will upgrade. You will need a little bit of deuterium. I'm not too concerned at the moment. Let's see if I can 
transport. I want to transport. Production of districts is increased by 2%. Well, this... The analysts... Okay, they now produce more nanites. Okay, we want... Maybe just the overall two. Do it. Uh, go for the eight. No, you died. Damn it. Oh, we officially ran out of dilithium. Crap. That's the Shiliac. Oh. There's the one down here. Okay. Um. Go with that system. Karma. Carmen? Sorry? Uh, come down to here. I was gonna say, you probably are running out of stuff. Uh, quote unquote, interesting. Um, actually, you come. You go to there. So when we have the moment, oh, you, um, we're going to build, obviously, a power station. So we need to fix our power problem before we do anything. Uh, you will do that. Yeah, there's not much I can do there at the moment. Theoretically, I can throw on an edict. Rojan will now guarantee the case on Okay. I don't know if you could hear that. That's my neighbor's car. <laughs> he, uh... Needs to fix his muffler. Okay. Oh! There we go! Min uh, Starbase influence. Plus three to our Starbase. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. Okay. So before we do anything, I want to upgrade some of these power stuff. Upgrade you, and then you. Um, and then I'll see if I have to re... Actually, no, I can do... Old and I can do that actually. So we're gonna do that. Oh, you just have the one. There we go. Um, uh, unimetric. Oh! Good timing. Uh, we're actually gonna do another uh, reactor for. Actually, you produce 30 power. You know what? I do need you a lot right now, so we'll do that. Forgot I was actually building those. Um, there's unit matrix 2 there. The United Federation of Planets. I bump into them over here. Okay. That was not expected. Let's add to you. Um, I kind of wish I could rank people from the population. Oh. Whole bunch of people leveling up there. You actually automatically produce 15 dilithium. I mean, Idrin already. Hmm. Let's 
Give me a definite mental notes. Seize the day. I mean, you're bordering me, so I might as well just do everything I can to start taking your planets and stuff, so... Oh, which reminds me of Fleet. I'm sitting at 228 of 237. Yeah. I'm at 15 of 15 there, 15 of 15 there, 8 of 15. Then a diamond. Another diamond. And then two spheres. Uh, more admin. Starbase influence cost reduction. I think I'm going to go with the admin. I'm getting pretty close here. Um... I'm just gonna upgrade you guys. Upgrade you guys. Plus six, nice. Where is this I'm bumping into? Over here. This is probably the Breen. That's what my assumption is gonna be. I'm just gonna take this because it's the least amount. Yep, the brain. There we go. That's the that's the fleet commanders I want. Um. Let's do another dilithium. Can never overproduce dilithium. And then after that, we'll do a mining network. Mining network. And then do two of those. Um, this won't be too bad, but that only gives me nanites, and nanites not a big issue. Let's go with mining station production. I already have the research thing going on, so let's do that. Let's see where that goes. Federations here. This could be the Cardassians. This could be... What else could that be? Down here, so this could also be the Lesepians. A couple different species that could be down there. Um, you're not moving anymore. Um, head down this way. The Frangie and the Tholen. Tholians. Whoa! Okay. That was kind of crazy. Uh, go there, then. Actually, no, go there. Um, you. I'm not too sure who that could have been. Oh, well, that's the Romulans right there. Order you that way. Oh, we got another unit matrix done. Let's get the next one up and running. Oh, can't do that yet. We're kind of capped out on those. I can go build a third one now. Right here. That's a double system. Um, there, go there. 
So I have one here, one here, and one down here. Ah, that's the Romulans, okay. Have you run to there then? Actually, go. Go to there. You might be able to get the Phasar and. No idea who that could be. So we've got Cardassians definitely down here, is probably what we're going to run into. We've got the Klingons, the Hasuk, or Hasnook, and the Fendamar over here. Let's take a better defensive army, why not? Gonna let them do their thing. Sibash Gana Dispunat. Move our fleets. There we go. Hasnuck. Send you to there. You to there. You to there. And I don't have any troops, do I? No, I do have troops. Uh, they're going to come to Robertson. There we go. The Cardassians. Tedans there. I'm gonna assume that's the Bajorans. That's the first federation. That was actually pretty quick and easy. Um, come in here. Let's see if you can kick that off. Um, okay, so the Fendemar don't exist. So you're gonna come down here. I'm going to assume we're going to get the Gorn and the Klingons, maybe? If they're even there. So my only concern... Oh, then there's Dodge over here, too. Yeah. So we're going to take Tap and then Idrin. Tap Idrin, double back, take dodge, or retake dodge, I should say. Um, yeah, I can't see them being much of a threat, so we'll take. There's a couple systems we'll take, and then we'll just kind of hold onto them a little bit. That will leave those ones. Problem is, there's so many that are like demon demon, like so take. Quark, I want to. I would love if they've colonized it, but they didn't. I'm happy with that. Cause the moment that I take that, I can just kind of sit back and laugh. Gosh, I'm meeting so many new species. What's going on here? Good 
think I'm good. Engine drone facility. Well, that's good to know, but yeah, there's nothing I can do with that. At the moment. Suban. Uh, now I can build sub complexes. Yes, please. Have a fleet. So I'm contemplating here just a little bit. Uh, let's go with better warp engines. Make people faster as like, yeah, the Klingons are guys. So I think other than whoever this is, we're done. That was nice timing. I think at this point we'll know everybody. Unless Bajor is still independent. In the Metatron, technically. Since you're down here, we'll see it. Ooh, the Temerians are all kind of over the place. Let's go there. We're still behind on power production. So I'm kind of tempted to contemplate what to do there. We've got a lot of uh, stuff I can upgrade. Term's maxed out at this point. Guess that's probably the Bajorans. Controls this system then. Who controls this? That alone is going to be interesting to try to figure out. upgrading power here we're producing power okay, you're gonna go there actually there we go. now I know the Metatron so yeah it's everybody so now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna scrap both these ships 
then I've got some stuff I'm going to do with these. In the meantime, though, let's get ready. Let's go to war with uh, you guys. Actually, hold on. Before I do that, save uh, the Borgi. Give it a few seconds to see if they call in anybody. Nope. Alright, we're good. So you're immediately gonna go there, then you're gonna come back here, and then you're gonna go there. Enoval, you're dumb. This is gonna take long. We're already We are Borg. Resistance is futile. We're gonna pause here real quick because there's so many notifications all of a sudden. Ah we lost. Okay. Take that off. Did they build? Okay. We're gonna get another system. Nice. Okay. Uh, you come up there. You go there, and more specifically, go there. Adrian for the next few minutes. We're just gonna actually reorganize this. There we go. Kazon have gotten ripped up pretty good. Take you because you're already pre researched. Not a to worry about. Oh, yeah, look at that dialect. Yeah. Oh, perfect. <laughs> wow. 
I love how we basically are landing our troops and then immediately going, oh, that's ours now. Um, they've got a planetary system here, actually. Yeah, I'm going to take uh, Gal Galargi. Why not? We've got a system right there. Just turn them into mass, like, generic uh, production things. Uh, oh, we're going to get the last thing here, which is assimilated units. Service influence cost reduction. So what do we want? We already have synthetic perfection, so organic population speed plus 33% increased production. We also have ascension perks. We have a plus 10% to our research speed. Oh, um, so it's a range, no. Naval capacity wouldn't be bad. Sturbase capacity wouldn't be bad. No, well, we're gonna go with more star bases. And the next one will be fleet. Plus 14. Uh... We're starting to, uh, wow, we're actually doing really good here. We're at 60% adaptation to their weapons. Oh yeah, they're gonna get destroyed there. But we are definitely assimilating these guys pretty quick. Uh, we're actually gonna order you. And army's there. Search is good to go. We'll take uh, better mining complexes, things like that, and more naval capacity. Oh, there we go, more unity and stuff like that. Nice, nice, nice. They're going to engage and just obliterate that fleet. Thank you. So we're going to take you. No, you can go there. <laughs> and you're being chased down, which is kind of funny. I think we're good to go. I was gonna say, you're gonna engage them immediately. One second. I want you to go there actually. Just make sure they don't take that system. where they went. Oh well, yeah, status quo. Perfect. 
Perfect. Alright, revenge done. Before we do anything, we've got to do some decisions here. We have to... Or is it an edict? It reduces passive unity production and to uh, uh, enable assimilation of addition. Yeah, okay, here we go. Oh, I need 16,000. I only have seven. Never mind. Basically, this makes assimilating... In this case, it'd be the Herogen faster. But that's not going to happen. Because we come over here and we look at our population. We actually have... What are... Okay. Let's go to Species. Yeah, we're going to be... Turning you into... Drones momentarily. We got Remen! How do we get Remens? Maybe it was my ship? The Dr and Druman? Okay. Bryn? I have no idea what ha some of these species are. So the problem here, right? We have, like, workers and... Uh, so right now we've got a lot of jobs here. So we're just going to upgrade you for now. So the funny thing about these things is I can upgrade them, while the planets I can't. But I can say, hey, let's demo that and build another power plant. Let's demo that and that. And grab... Maintenance Depot and Power. I should build a Maintenance Depot here as well. Frankie in here. I wonder where the Frankie came from. Erosion. Kazon. So we still have three of you guys. And they live on two current planets. I'm assuming it's one of these systems. Yeah, right now you got we have two unemployed medial drones. Let's have a lot of space base, or the things now here. Um, they're getting replaced there. Idrin's is also getting replaced. are starting to look up. So 
So what I want to do is move anything that's not bored out of here. Complete. Like you're all not Borg, so you will not be moved. Ah, uh, yeah, no Borg. So we wait. Just take some random stuff here. Um, let's start doing. Nope, wrong thing. Um, I gotta start contemplating what stuff I really need to work on. Power, I think, is still a thing. Nanite production is not a thing. Uh, alloys are at a hundred, so let's go with power first from you. You get housing. A lot of you guys were gonna wait. Cause, oh, no, we have three unemployed, okay. And no available jobs, that's actually a good thing. Uh, we're actually gonna do another power facility. Okay. Getting the ability to move around your own people over the once in a while is gonna be a good thing. But yeah, there we go. We got a revenge on the Herogen. Seize the day. Now we need to make our move on the Kobali. Now we're gonna work everyone to go and repair. We're also gonna go to Unit Matrix One. We're gonna say armies. Okay, that I'm not too worried about. Twelve. Well, we're actually going to be recruiting three Herogen from you, three Herogen from you, three Herogen from you. Okay, let's do more mineral storage. Assault army damage. There's better force fields for ships, I think. Move some pe more people over. There we go. Only two people there. Power. Still nobody there yet. What I might do too is move people around a little bit. Um, yeah, and our fleets are our fleets can get a lot bigger now too, which is good. So I didn't know if I told all these to upgrade. I'm also going to build some more star bases, obviously. So that's 13, 14. Fifteen. I know. <laughs> Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This one. 13. And we can move them around a little later. Okay, so what do I want to go in the direction of next? I go to adaptability. Uh, population housing reduction just by adopting it. Finisher effects. Adopting all accessibility, blah, blah, blah. We get 15% uh, more unity. This gives us nanites, mass production, hit points. Some cost that will be good now that we're growing. Uh, army damage, fire rates, uh, apartment damage, fleet command limit by 40. So, yeah, we're doing that one. Oh, 
put us a little bit above our limit. It's not far off, actually. It's only like a tiny bit over. Because as these star bases get built, I'm going to be, you know, in, uh, increasing my uh, naval capacity, anyways. And I'm going to put an end to this episode. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.